Is temporary staffing a permanent solution? Leaders all over the globe are dealing with uncertainty across the business environment. Companies are facing lower revenues, capital shortages, and loss of business. This has resulted in the need for solutions that meet demands while remaining low cost and flexible. The onset of these pandemic times has led to widespread job losses of permanent full-time employees as work became less and, as a result, lower demand for full-time employees. Over time, new problems have arisen that require more employees than usual to manage and cope with day-to-day -day operations. Companies now require a more flexible workforce with lowered costs. This has resulted in increased popularity for temporary staffing solutions. So, what is this new trend in staffing? Temporary staffing is hiring employees for a specific period of time rather than onboarding them permanently. This allows companies access to specific skill sets in a flexible and cost-efficient manner. This workforce solution is especially great for uncertain times as normalcy could result in less problem situations and fewer requirements for human capital. Industries such as retail, cleaning, light industry and distribution are heavily dependent on temporary staff members. From an employee's perspective, there are substantial benefits for them as well. With an abundance of job losses due to the pandemic, such temporary opportunities offer a chance to work and earn income. Temp work also enables people to potentially transition into a permanent role once normalcy is restored. One study shows that 68% of the people who have done temporary work are now in permanent positions. As businesses see increased efficiency, lower cost, and high agility within their workforce, they are becoming more inclined to shift the way they hire post-normalcy as well. Is your organization thinking about implemented temporary staff? If so, learn more by downloading this white paper, Temporary Staffing, a Permanent Solution, at OnlineWhitePapers.com today.